the rush to build wind farms to combat climate change, is colliding with preservation of golden eagles, iconic birds in the western United States. We want to get ahead of it. We don't want to wait until the species is endangered. Golden eagles, as they're flying, they don't necessarily perceive this gap between the turbine blades. And so as they're flying through uh, and the turbine is spinning, it strikes the eagle. And the collision with wind turbines for a golden eagle is usually fatal. Wind power is one of many threats to golden eagles. Rising temperatures from climate change also reduce their breeding grounds. Since wind energy is one of the most promoted solutions to climate change, it gets complicated. These combined risks to golden eagles, including wind power, are leading scientists to monitor the birds. The population is teetering on the edge of decline. Here goes nothing. Part of what we're doing as scientists is trying to understand where the decline is coming from and uh, develop a long-term conservation plan that makes sense. Got it. Recently, energy companies have been held accountable for deaths of golden eagles and other federally protected birds. If growth in wind energy stays the course, a government study projects turbine deaths could cut golden eagle populations by almost half around 2050. One thing that I think is very encouraging is that wind energy companies, many of them are working very closely with scientists to look at ways to mitigate losses. Trying to find the right balance in preserving the future of eagles and wind power simultaneously. Emma H. Tobin, Associated Press.